That's Lisaldo in the little red truck. I am under the roof right now because it's been raining all day since yesterday. Look at the fog, La Noblina. All right, on top of the mountains there. I'm gonna step outside while I smoke this cigarette and it's raining, but I got my outer box so that should protect my iPhone. The emergency system has been going off as you can hear it. This is my grandmother's house. Second floor was never finished. That's the first floor, looks very nice. This is Gio's little day woo that he's got for parts. This is a Mazda 929 that he's got for, I don't know what the fuck. But look at that, I see, see how it's all foggy and stuff? Wow, it's raining hard. I'm already getting wet, I'm gonna fucking with this. I'm gonna go get under the covers, under the uh, roof thing. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna take this bitch. I'm gonna take my glass of soda and my cigarette. I'm gonna go uptown so I can give you a better view. My screen's getting wet. All right, so I'm in. Put this chair up here so I can, you know, lean back and watch, but. Is this from up here? This is Hurricane, or... <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Tropical Storm Isaac. It's been like this all day. It's about... 5 o'clock in the afternoon right now and uh, pretty windy I would I would we'll go to the back but see if I can get to the back oh you can't even see but look at the palm trees blowing All the winds, the flag. You got to see if you can see the flag flapping over there. Anyway, the crazy shit is that people are riding ATVs and uh, motorcycles. Uh, excuse me. People are going surfing. This is when you get the nice waves. And yeah, this is basically what Puerto Rico looks like when uh, when there's a tropical storm. Uh, people are still up and about. Look at the grass. This is like an epa tree. It supersedes the house big time. My dad's got one of those trucks, but it's blue pretty sexy but uh, yeah it's raining it looks like crap we still got electricity we still got TV signal It's got platanos back there. And, uh, yeah. We're taking it pretty chill. You can see I got, uh, <clears throat> my cup of soda. Right there. I don't know if you can hear the wind. But, uh, look at those canepas right there. Those little round dots there, those little circles, those things are ready to go. If I had a machete I'd, and I could reach that shit, I'd fucking chop this bitch down.
I would chop it down. And I got fucking canepas up to Wazoo. And these canepas are fucking awesome. It just pisses me off that apparently nobody else in this town has got, or in this village, has got this tree. So everybody comes to my fucking gate. Well, not to my gate. It's right now my brother's house. Even though my aunt's, my aunt swears this is her house. But yeah, they come to the house and they come and climb up the steps I came up. And as you can see, there's no canepas down here. Because everybody has clipped them. The whole town comes over here, the whole village comes over here to grab our canepas. Just got me a little b pissed off, but it's whatever. Yesterday, there's a goat over there. Yesterday, I spoke to my uncle. My uncle said, cut that bitch down. If you want to cut it down, cut it down. So, uh, <laughs> this bitch right here is going to come down. I'm bringing it down. I don't give a fuck. Look at that. There's a big ass, damn, a bunch of fucking canepas up there. So, yeah, what I'll do is I'll, I'll bring it down. I'll cut this tree down. And then I will put one, because I like these canepas. I'm going to put one back there. See that jungle, that big, those big leaves in the back? like a tree with big ass fucking leaves and banas on it behind that and then any fuck anything that all this grass right here I'm gonna fucking take a I'm gonna take a machete and chop all this shit down my brother says he can't do it cause he's uh his excuse is that he's diabetic I don't know but I'm gonna fucking I'm gonna cut that shit down. Look at this Jeep Wrangler over there. Four by four static. Got the big truck tires, a snorkel, got a rompe monte. Look at these two crackheads right here. That's one crackhead, and here comes the other one following. Crackhead number two. Those two characters right there never have money, always asking for quarters, 50 cents, a dollar. Their parents do, do shopping for food and they grab the food and sell the food so they can get their fix. And that's fucking sad. But I don't want to partake so I don't give them shit. No cigarettes, no quarters, no nothing. Or I don't have anybody giving me quarters or cigarettes. I ain't going to fucking give them out. Alright people, I'm going to make another video later, so you can see, uh, see the palm trees back there. And I move the camera, when I move the camera, it's like, I notice it with my eyes, so I move the camera, when I move the camera, they stop swaying. But yeah, it's not too bad. I'm wearing a t-shirt. I got my beard all shaggy on purpose because it keeps me warm. <laughs> no, I don't have my machine right now. I gotta get my machine and left it at my cousin's house. Otherwise, I would trim this up, you know? Trim it up real nice so I could look sexy. But, uh, hasn't happened yet. So, later on after this storm passes, I will... I will grab my sheet, my machine, and hook up my face. Maybe get a haircut. I go to my cousin Miggy's house right quick. And get a haircut and hook up my face. And I'll be fucking ready to rock. Ready to rock? Yeah. All right, people. Peace.